Hello and welcome to Quick Tips, the WordPress video series. In this video, I'm going to install the free HubSpot CRM plugin in a WordPress website. I'll show you how to install and set up the HubSpot CRM in the WordPress website. I'll also show you how you can create the live chat and the contact forms in HubSpot CRM and using these forms, you can collect leads on your WordPress website. For example, this is the contact form that I have created using the HubSpot CRM plugin. And this is the live chat option that I have installed using the same plugin. So I'll show you how you can enable the live chat and how you can create a contact form. So when someone fills up the contact form or when someone send you the message through the live chat, it will automatically create the contact in the CRM. You can go to the contacts and you will see the list of all the contacts in the CRM. Now the HubSpot is not the WordPress hosted CRM plugin. You are going to create an account on HubSpot website and all the data will be saved on the HubSpot server. So it's not the self hosted CRM plugin. You can say that the plugin is going to embed the HubSpot CRM into your WordPress website. So we are going to create a free account on the HubSpot website. The free account has limitations. In previous videos, I have shown you how to use the CRM plugin, which are self hosted on WordPress website. All the data will be saved on your WordPress website and you can create unlimited contacts and you can also create unlimited campaigns using these plugins. For example, Fluent CRM, Next CRM and Jetpack CRM. So these three plugins are self-hosted CRM plugins for the WordPress. In case of HubSpot, all the data will be saved on the HubSpot server and there are limitations to create the contact list. For example, if you go to the startup plan, you can create up to 1000 contacts. So these are the limitations with the HubSpot CRM. If you want to watch the previous videos about Fluent CRM, Next CRM or Jetpack CRM, I'll give you the links in the description box. You can watch these videos also and then decide which plugin will be better option for your website requirements. Using Fluent CRM or the Next CRM, you can create email marketing automations. There are no limitations. You can create unlimited automations using these plugins. In case of Jetpack CRM, this plugin is more about sales where you can send codes and invoices to the customers automatically. You can also create automations. However, you need to add some extensions. I have explained that in the previous videos. You can watch that video. So let's see how we can install the free WordPress HubSpot CRM plugin. Do not forget to subscribe to Quick Tips YouTube channel. Watch new videos about website design, e-commerce websites, search engine optimization, social media marketing, WordPress tutorials, video editing tips and many more. Press the bell icon to get instant notification whenever we publish new videos. So here I'm logged into the dashboard of the WordPress website and now I'm going to install the free HubSpot CRM plugin. So let's go to plugins and click on add new plugin. Here search for HubSpot CRM. And this is the plugin that we are going to install HubSpot CRM, email marketing, live chat, forms and analytics. Click on install now. And click on activate. Now you can create a new account. And if you already have an account on HubSpot, you can sign into your account. So I'm going to create a new account here. So you can enter your email address or you can also use continue with Google or sign up with Microsoft. So I'm going to use this method email address. Click on verify email address. It is going to send one email. I just need to verify that email. You will see an email like this. We need to confirm that email address. So I'm going to copy this link and I'm going to open the email link. All right, so I need to set up the password also. So from here, I'm going to set up the password. Click next. Now we need to add the first name, last name. This will be the company name. You can add your company name. This will be the website address. How many people work at your company? I'm going to select this one. What industry are you in? So I'm going to select marketing and advertising which best describes your role, All right? So I'm going to select, I have never used a CRM before. This is about where would you like your data to be hosted? I'm going to select US and click on create an account. So basically we are going to create an account on HubSpot. 
So all the data will be saved on the HubSpot. Click on connect website. So now we have created an account on the HubSpot and it is going to show you a demo. So click on start demo. So this is basically the demo of the dashboard. This is the marketing dashboard. You will see deals closed versus goal. Click next. With this plugin, you can capture visitors information with ease. No help from a developer needed. You can create forms. This is about the contact the tracking activity list. Here you can exit the demo. All right, so we are out of the demo now. Let's go to settings here. All right, so these are the basic settings forms. All right, now from here you can create a chat flow, create a form or manage contacts. So let's go to manage contacts. So it will basically go to the HubSpot CRM from where you can manage the contact. All right, here it says want to embed this tool in WordPress, enable third party cookies. All right, so in order to embed this tool in the WordPress dashboard, you need to allow the cookies. So you can go here. I'm using Chrome Go to cookies and data click on third party cookies. So I have enabled the third party cookies now click on reload. Now all the data will be shown in the WordPress dashboard. You don't need to go to the HubSpot CRM. It will be shown on your WordPress website itself. So these are the three options, forms, contacts and live chat. You can create a live chat for your website. You can create forms and you can manage the contacts from here. So let's go to manage contacts. And this will show the list of contacts, all contacts, my contacts, unassigned contacts. You can create a new contact. Click on create new contact. And here you can enter the email address, phone number, last name and create the new contact. Here you will see actions. If you have any contact list, you can import the contact list from here. Here you will see import a file or sync contacts directly from the other apps. Let's create one form here and let's see how we can use the contact form to collect the leads. So let's click on create form. So I'm going to select this one immediate form. Click next. This will be the name of the forms. I'm going to name it as HubSpot. And this is how the form will look. We have email address, first name, last name, message. This is basically the template registration. So these are the templates that you can use or you can create from the blank. It will give you an option to enter the email address. So I'm going to select this one. Contact us and click create form. Right. So it says your form is ready. You can use this form on WordPress page or you can use it as a block or you can use it as a short code. So you can copy the short code. I'm going to copy the short code and let's close this one. The form is created. Let's go to one of the pages here. And we have one sample page. I'm going to edit the sample page. All right. And here I'm going to add a short code. This is just a sample page. So I'm going to enter the short code, click update and click on view page. And this is how the form will look. All right. You can customize this layout as of now I'm using the sample page only. Let's try adding some dummy data here. Here I have added some dummy data. I'm going to click on submit now. And it says thanks for submitting the form. Again, as I said earlier, you can customize this page layout. So we have filled up the form. Let's go back to the HubSpot CRM. Let's go back to the dashboard. Let's go to contacts. And you will see a new contact is created. Let's click on preview. It will show the details of this contact. The name, the email address. You can also create a note from here. You can change the stage lead subscriber marketing qualified lead. You can also create activity lead status new open in progress. So this is all about the CRM activities for this contact. You can also create ticket deals, companies, subscription payment. All this information is available here. Now let's go to live chat option here. And let's create a new chat. So we are going to add the chat. So this is the option selected. Got any questions? Click next. 
select an inbox that will be live chat so leave it as it is click next and this is the question got any questions i'm happy to help this is what it is here if you want to change it you can change it from here ask visitors for their email address immediately after first message is sent so this is what the option is don't have time to wait for a response leave your email and we will be in touch as soon as possible so i'm not going to make any changes here let's click on publish the chat flow your live chat is published advanced customization in hubspot so it will go to hubspot and i'm on the sample page and you can see that the live chat is available on the sample page Let's open it and this is how the live chat will look so i'm going to add a message and when i enter the message it will show we will return at 7 30 so this is the message from the chat bot so i'm going to open this page in another browser right now i'm logged into the wordpress dashboard here so i'm going to open it in another browser where i'm not logged in let's click on chat all right so this is the next message don't have time to wait for a response leave your email so i'm going to add another email here thank you for your email we will be in touch as soon as possible let's go back to the dashboard contacts and you will see that the new contact is created if i go to preview it will show the details of this contact so using the contact form and the live chat you can collect your leads let's go to hubspot website and let's see the pricing all right so for the new customer you will see that this is the pricing 20 dollars per month this is the startup plan this is professional and this is enterprise level plan the startup plan will cost you $18 that is approximately $216 per year and in that you will be able to create a list of 1000 marketing contacts and these options are available forms, email marketing, landing pages, live chat, email and in-app chat support, payments US only. So these are the basic features of the startup plan. The other plan is professional plan that will cost you $800 per month. So these are the features of the HubSpot CRM. You can create contact list. You can capture the leads using the form and the live chat. In previous videos, I have shown you how to use the Fluent CRM, which is a self-hosted WordPress plugin. You can create unlimited campaigns. You can create unlimited contacts and you can also create email automation using the Fluent CRM as well as the next CRM plugin. So you can also watch these previous videos. I have published separate videos on Fluent CRM, Next CRM and Jetpack CRM. You can compare all these plugins and then decide which plugin will be suitable for your website requirements. If you are looking for more advanced CRM, then you can go for the HubSpot. Otherwise, if you are looking for email marketing automation or sales CRM, you can go for Fluent CRM or Jetpack CRM. So this is how you can use the free WordPress HubSpot CRM plugin. So that's it for now. See you in the next video. Do not forget to subscribe to my channel to get more quick tips about online softwares and tools. If you have any questions, please leave us message in comment section and press the like button if you like the video. Thanks for watching quick tips.